my name is Eleanor. I'm at today I'm at the Mobile Museum of Art and I will be reading you Henri Scissors by Jeanette Wood. Matisse got as close as one can get to heaven with a pair of scissors. Romar Bearden. In a small weaving town in France, a young boy named Henri Emile Benoit Matisse watched his mother paint china. He wanted to paint too. He drew pictures in the sand and drew pictures in his sketchbook. <clears throat> when Henri was a young man, he drew pictures in his law books and on contracts, deeds, and wills. Henri was, a, was sick in bed with appendicitis one winter. His mother gave him a box of paint and he painted until he was well. He kept on painting, forgot about law, and left his small town to be an artist in Paris. Henri painted pictures day after day and year after year. He was happy and his paintings made people happy. But, Matisse would, but when Matisse was an old man, he fell ill. So ill he couldn't paint. So ill he couldn't sit up. So ill he could only lie in bed and sleep. His paintings floated by in his dreams. Matisse finally opened his eyes and they were filled with sadness. Now he must remain in bed or use a wheelchair. Would he ever have the energy to paint again? When Matisse was strong enough to travel, he went to the seaside. The air might help him get well. Before long, he sat up. A little later, he drew. Then one day, Matisse picked up a pair of scissors and cut out shapes. From painted paper, he was drawing with scissors. A pair of scissors is a wonderful instrument. Matisse cut paper all day. My pleasure in cutting things out grows even greater. Why didn't I think of it earlier? His assistants painted paper for him all day. It seems that I'm in a second life. Paper cutouts covered his walls. One evening, Matisse lay in bed and drew the faces of his grandchildren on the ceiling with a piece of chalk tied to a long pole. As he fell asleep, they looked down on him and saw his dreams. They saw the shapes that surrounded him in sleep. As time went on, Matisse got bigger and bigger shapes. They filled his seaside room with color. You see, as I am obligated to remain often in bed, I have made a little garden all around me where I can walk. There are leaves, fruits, a bird. I am deeply contented, happy. <clears throat> then one night, Matisse walked out into his gar paper garden, and the rainbow of shapes cradled the old artist and carried him into the heavens. Are some of the stars we see at night coming to us from Henri Scissors? Perhaps. Though produced by a very old man who is mortally ill, the cutouts seem to come from the springtime of the world. John Nussle.